Hi, I'm Chris with APS EdTech, and this is a quick tip video on how to change your language and add an on-screen keyboard to your Dell PC laptops. This is a quick video on how to change your language on a Dell PC laptop. First thing you want to do is click on the Windows button in the bottom left corner. Then click on the settings wheel. Then go to language. Once you're on language, you will add an additional language. Right now I only have English added. If I click on add a language, I can start typing in the language I would like to add to my computer. Uh, if I want Spanish, I have to choose which country I would like it to be for. And then click next and then click Install. Now it will be here under my list once it's in, oh, it's down here in my list under Install. I can go to my keyboard and I can change my language here on the keyboard. I can also go back down here to the search button and go to on-screen keyboard. It should be here, it's the on-screen keyboard. You can actually turn it on for your Dell and then right now I have it set to Spanish, so I've got my accent marks, my enye, um, all those for the Spanish language set to the keyboard. And I can use this keyboard to type on uh, Google Docs, Google Classroom, emails, whatever I would like to type into. Once you've added a language to your keyboard, so I've got English and Spanish down here, if I click up here on keyboard, I can um, set some things so that it's easier to find in the future. If I click on language bar options, I can show additional language bar icons in the taskbar. Um, if I click OK on that, now down here at the bottom, I can click here and change my keyboard from English to Spanish and set my language preferences. What I can do is I can pin that on-screen keyboard so it's easy to find in the future. I'm going to click on the Windows button, and then I'm going to type in a search for the on-screen keyboard. It's going to pop up here. But down below in the bar, I can see that little on-screen keyboard icon. If I right click on it, I can then pin it to the taskbar. Then when I close the keyboard when I'm done using it, I can just click on it to bring it back up again and I don't have to search for it every time I want to use it. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out our YouTube channel for more quick tip videos. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video.